Wow, Bitcoin's on the run. You won't believe the next target. Today for the Bitcoin price with DaVinci J15, we will be talking about Bitcoin because guys, look at this. Bitcoin is on the run right now. And this is exactly what we will be talking about. We hit the 9,000 US dollar level exactly like we've been talking about that last week and also three weeks ago. We hit it on the dollar right here. And now the question is, of course, if this move is over or if we can expect much, much higher price target here, even in the immediate short term, we will talk about the exact price target, about the exact trading plan here from DaVinci J15. And we will also be going um, onto ethereum because what's going to happen there is even more unbelievable this and more in today's episode make sure you stick here around for the whole duration of the episode because in the end we will be sharing with you criminal activities corrupt activities here from the federal reserve they are helping out friends and family with the massive massive corporations ba bailout here guys we will be talking about all of that everything what we can expect right now with the number one um, guy to talk to here in the financial crisis and, and in this crazy crazy volatile times so make sure you stick around make sure you smash up the like button guys please scroll down click the like button right now it is completely free for you and it cheers us up a lot to at least 3,000, 3,500 or more likes. Thank you so much for that, guys. And now I want to come to the most important question of today. Da Vinci J15, the number one guy to talk to today. How are you doing today, my man? Man, I'm doing great. Well, Bitcoin's at 9,000, man. How are you feeling today? <laughs> I'm also doing very well, man. And um, man, you nailed it. This AB equals CD trade. I mean, we exactly hit the price target. Maybe before, thanks for asking, I'm doing well. But maybe before we are pulling out the charts or why you are pulling out the charts, let me play um, the audience this clip here from the video three weeks ago where you actually made this AB equals CD um, move. So guys, look at this clip here quickly. To see the charts, but the, if you're in this green box zone, that's where you want to be. That's where you want to buy because that's the best price action you're going to get. Well, there might be a little bit of traffic on the way, but I think we'll, we'll definitely get up to the $9,000 level this month, sometime this week or this month um, for sure. All right, guys, you saw it. I mean, we exactly hit the price target right now. And now, of course, the question is, Da Vinci, what do you think? What is next for the Bitcoin price? What are your next price targets? What is your game plan right now, especially for Bitcoin, but also, also afterwards for Ethereum? So maybe we can pull up the charts and see what is your magic TA saying right now? All right, let's take a look. Let's take a look. You know what? Um, good thing markets never close because you know what? I was thinking, ah, let's just close up shop and go home. <laughs> no. <laughs> the market will always be here so uh even if you miss a move just let it go and you know another bust in 10 minutes so just remember always remember that that market is 24 7 now not whatever the the bankers say <laughs> exactly <laughs> especially our exactly. market our market of bitcoin all right so with that said uh wow what a move here uh we got this thing moving like, like we said last week we're gonna move up to nine thousand, and here we are uh, in the middle of the week, um, uh, we're at the 9,000 level, and where do we go from here? I said we were going to blast through this this one trend line, um, and I think that with all the momentum and all the FOMO coming in, I wouldn't be surprised if the next level has to be the 61.8, uh, which is around $10,022. Uh, I think we're going to leave a candle wick up there and then come back for a retest down in, on this level retest this this lower trend line before we actually decide to go higher but yeah um, let's no. let's see how that plays out let's go to the shorter time frames here on, on, on the weekly you are saying that it is possible here on the weekly to break the uh, nine thousand something level and also go all the way up close to the ten thousand level here breaking this downward sloping trend line here do you think this is possible and yeah now being on the shorter time frames what do you think has to happen here also on the daily candles and the four hour candles that we can see this price targets of ten thousand this week yeah, so looking at the looking at the daily candle, you can see that there is no divergence here. We are in fresh territory for to make the FOMO boys uh, with the lots of uh, uh, tether dollars buy in this thing like there's no tomorrow. And there probably is going to be when we talk about that news article <laughs> that we're going to be talking about in a little bit. But yes, uh, we can see that even though we're above the outside the Bollinger Bands. 
Uh, no, the market could stay irrational for longer than you can stay solvent. Well, actually, stay manipulated <laughs> is mm -hmm. what, what uh, Keynes really meant. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> yeah. So, uh, yeah, this is probably going to be uh, a nice manipulated. This is a nice manipulated move. You can see that the, the buyer, the, 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 the people who are sitting on the sidelines, okay, I'm waiting for a dip, waiting for a dip, because we were waiting for a dip there, a 38.2, and we never got it. So now, once it took off, they just FOMO'd in like crazy. There was no dip buying, and there's just like crazy, just like uh, insane buying. Uh, going down to the four hour, just to see what, what we have there. I haven't actually looked at it myself, actually. Right? Oh, I was just taking a look at the, the AB equals CD that I had here. And you have this, this, this is a trend line. This was a, no, this was a support line. And look at that, we touched that as well. So let's zoom in on that. We have pulled back only a little bit. Wow, unbelievable. Look at the, where the 13 AMA is. Just like wow. miles away from the price action. Incredible. Let's take a look at the RSI. Yeah, just, 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 just close the, the door on any kind of like, we had like, a, a, what's it called? Divergence down here before and then just now just close the door. Uh, on that and 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 there's just so much momentum here that I would not get in front of any of this here the momentum is going higher I would I would not put it past these these guys to like break this what, what why did I draw this trend line that's an interesting trend line because we we also topped this one as well and touched this one as well you can see this trend line yes uh, this this was a long term drawn, drawn trend line and we touched it and came back off of it not once but twice man maybe you can even count the second candle third candles right so if we break that we created like a, a pennant or you could yeah i'd call it a pennant like a uh, this wedge here and that was the bottom part of that wedge and so we're coming to visit that bottom the the, the bottom half of the wedge wedge and we're going hey you know what can we break through this bottom part of the wedge so i think that's what the that's what the market wants to do sorry let me just zoom in back on that auto size and there we go so yeah looking zooming back into here there we go zooming back in here we looks like we want to break into that area which is like what price is that let me just move your that is uh 8955 we break through that 10,000 here we go wow so you are saying if we are breaking this level here close to the nine thousand us dollar level um today tomorrow whatever then this week even ten thousand dollars are possible exactly amazing, Probably, if amazing. not this if not this by the end of the weekend definitely next week so yeah so this let's phrase it like this this or next week and before we go into the next topic here guys everyone watching right now and please every single one we need engagement on that because we want to make some sentiment analysis i want to know from you guys do you think a price target of ten thousand dollars this week or let's say latest next week is possible possible please take part at the poll it is popping up on top of the screen right now click the poll and say yes or no whether it's possible to reach ten thousand this or next week um or not and this would be actually before the halving, if you remember it correctly. So, Da Vinci, what is next up here for Ethereum? And before we go into Ethereum, Da Vinci, I wanted to ask you, because if I remember it correctly, you had a um, promotion for Pandora's wallet here. Just for a few seconds before we go into Ethereum, guys, make sure you stick around for that. Um, and this one is ending today, man. It's like the 30th of April. You said only until April. Is that correct? So what about this promotion yeah. on Pandora's wallet? Yeah, well, if, if the promotion is like we, you have one more day left until um, uh, May first uh, UTC time. That's uh, midnight UTC time. Um, you have uh, uh, May first, um, and then you could th that that the promotion is over. Basically, you'll have access to my um, private Telegram group forever, forever. Um, we're gonna, we're gonna, you're gonna have access to my help. I we, we I show people cool trading tricks, things that I don't show the rest of the people on on uh, on the regular YouTube video sh show. And also, we talk about about how to trade the altcoins and which altcoins are best as, as well. And you see, you have access to my whole portfolio. What am I buying? What am I selling? And when I'm selling, and so forth. And you could do that with just buying one month subscription. Just one month. 
And also, if you buy uh, two years of subscription, you'll also uh, be able to um, ask me to um, um, talk about a particular cryptocurrency that you're interested in as well. So with that said, let's head over to Ethereum. Yes, um, everyone who wants to take advantage of that, today, even tomorrow, the 1st of April, last chance, scroll down. This is the last chance in the pinned comment. There is a link to Pandora's wallet. You can take a monthly subscription only even and um, yeah, take advantage of all of that. So first of all, Da Vinci, we have Bitcoin. Bitcoin still is looking still bullish. There is still some upside to go, uh, some, some, some potential upside side in case we break the 9,000 something like close to 9,000 US dollar level we can even see here this on next week 10,000 US dollars however Da Vinci for Ethereum things are even crazier because everyone remember you can scroll back and fact check that yourself we have been talking about Ethereum and a potential price target here close to the 250 US dollar level and I want to know from you uh, Da Vinci um, do you think that 250 or close to 250 240 something is still valid for Ethereum do you think this is still possible yes definitely i mean like i think along with uh bitcoin uh, um this thing's got some legs to run and so i think the 78.6 so if i was like a trader uh i uh, well i am a trader <laughs> i've got that <laughs> and uh but mostly I, I i consider myself a software developer but anyways uh i would i'm have this uh, i have my uh what's it called uh so it's called my Hail Mary trade. And basically, you do a Hail Mary at the 78.6. And the reason why it's called the Hail Mary is because you, um, the market tends to go screaming to the 78.6. And so you're basically like going, Hail Mary, God, Mother, <laughs> Mother of God, pray for us sinners from now until the end of time. Because... <laughs> It's damn scary <laughs> to take a yeah. short, to take a trade at the seventy eight point six, and in this case, we're talking about a short, and that's down to um, we're all the way down taking a two to one short, all the way back down to here, which this is a possibility, right? Um, just that we're gonna. I would. Uh, I, I'm. I'm a little nervous about that short. I'm thinking about it. But I have to see what the the daily candles look like. Yes. Right. Yes, Do yes, we start course. seeing some sort of like a divergence or something like that? Something to say, yeah, maybe I should, maybe I could take this in with a little bit more confidence. But if it's if it screams there up there today or something like that uh, or tomorrow, yeah, forget it. Um, yes, yes. I'm not gonna take it. Anymore. And even so, though this is see. even though this is a short trade, a p p potential short trade, this has an inherent bullish message now because you this short ha trade has a potential. Um, yeah, starting price of 246. So you are saying that 246 for Ethereum is a potential target here in the short term here on the daily candles, right? Yeah, correct. You can see lots of traffic here. Right, there's a failed um, uh, move up here, and it, it collapsed. I mean, there's a lot of confluence here, so I mean that's why it's, I'm starting to look at this and go, yeah, it's a scary trade, but it's looking really good, looking really good. It is, wow. and so um, yeah, I might I I have a long trade open on uh, on this, on so I'm definitely going to take profits here, definitely. Nice. There's no if buts about that. <laughs> It, it will be basically insane profits because I remember you have been talking about this price level all the way back way below $200, like at $160 or whatever, something like this. You were already talking about the price targets of 246 And guys, look at this. We are very, very close already in crypto terms, more than 10%. This is close in crypto. So great, Da Vinci. Great, great, great. Thank you so much for sharing that with us. And now the best thing comes always in the end. Da Vinci, you have been showing me that article. Um, it is actually quite disgusting to see that, to, to phrase it here in, in very, very mild terms. And you can already see here Steve Mnuchin. And um, this, the headline of this article is right now, the Federal Reserve and Treasury Department program will offer corporations, and guys, read the subtext here, $500 billion, no strings attached bailout loophole. I mean, this is crazy. This is crazy, Da Vinci. What are your thoughts on this corrupt 
news here actually you can call it a corrupt news so what are your thoughts on that the federal reserve here now offering this no strings attached um yeah loophole to friends and family yeah so just so you know right that if it's no strings attached that means that snoochy booji can call up his friend at uh, jp morgan and say hey hey dog are you still working at jp morgan we're gonna hook you up with a bailout you just you know pass some of my way right to my family members and stuff like that you hook me up please that would be great <laughs> i mean yes. that's you know that's going to be going down like if he's not doing it somebody else is doing it inside the uh the administration and that's 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 i mean that's what criminals do i mean it's it's sad but that's when you have access to the printing press your people are going to be able to going to find ways to steal from the printing press exactly. and this is literally what's going to happen here when you see that this 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 massive amount of money is just they're going to be handing out with no zero strings attached because they don't have to worry about well we're, we have to spend this on on uh, labor we have to spend this on the business no 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 they can spend it on giving themselves big bonuses <laughs> can, you, can we go into the face mode? You are completely right. And Da Vinci, what I wanted to say, can we go into the face mode? What you are saying is perfectly true. You are saying it's stealing from the printing press. And the reason for that is, guys, when they are helping out the corporations like that by freshly printed money, they are stealing from you. They are stealing from every single one of you. Because by putting that currency, that fiat currency into circulation, helping out the corporations, they are stealing your purchasing power. And by when they are stealing your purchasing power they are stealing your time they are stealing your freedom because you have been working working uh, for the savings you have put aside and when you lose your purchasing power by their actions they are stealing your money they are stealing your currency they are stealing your freedom they are stealing your purchasing power guys and the only reason the the only reason why we are doing this video we are want to give you a we want to give you a loophole out of this you want, we want to give you an option out of this and you can actually vote against the scam by um yeah saving your purchasing power by saving your time your freedom by buying things like gold silver and bitcoin guys you have to understand the implications of these um, corrupt actions which are right now in front of your eyes I mean, you can see it even in the mainstream media. Um, they are already covering that. So, Da Vinci, thank you so much for sharing that. I think these times are so important. It is very key to um, to anticipate what's about to come in the future and also to to interpret these things correctly and to understand that what they are doing is is actually theft. It's theft on your time. It's theft on your purchasing power. So, thank you so much for that, Da Vinci. And this episode was extremely important. The Bitcoin price in the short term, the Ethereum price in the short term, it's always nice to look at. It's always nice to take some, some trades from that and um, make some gains from it. Um, shout out to everyone who was acting on that here recently. And yeah, please share me your thoughts. We are actually breaking out right now as we speak. I saw that. Um, the price is actually, price action is right where, where we are about to break out. And I'm wondering if we're going to do so before you upload this video. Kind of, kind of interesting. I just want to quickly show before we end the sh end the um, the stream uh, what's going on. Look at that! Look at look at that! We are right up there, and I think we're going to break out and go mm. a lot higher really fast. Um, it's it's <laughs> incredible. If you look at the uh, other charts here, we look at other charts. You can see Whoa, a little what bit a of a pattern breakout. happening. Crazy. Right. Um, let's just take a look at. Um, let's see here. Um, wow. We are knocking out the 9,000 as we speak. Is this, uh, yeah, this is the Bitcoin chart, five, seven, five minute chart. So this, as you can see here, you can't, maybe you can't see it, but let me just clear up some of the other um, stuff here because it's, it's incredible. Um, um, so basically, uh, yeah, I had a sm small long there, but anyways. Um, you can see we are creating what's called a, a, a triangle. A, what's it called? A, um, a, a a triangle pattern here. So um, you can draw from here to here, right? I'm just I'm gonna uh, just roughly do it because I, I know we've, we've gone too long on the stream. But yeah, you can see right here, maybe right here to here, and of course at the top here. Oh right yeah. Here, wow to hear that we're breaking out right so this is this is and you can see all the w i see w's everywhere you see w's everywhere yeah w i see here them. w here w here w here i mean this is this is very strong um 
I think by the time you upload this stream, we might be in the 9500 level. So, all right. Well, uh, that's it, folks, man. This is exciting times. Exciting times, man. Exciting times. What a nice episode. Thank you so much, Da Vinci, for sharing all of that with us. Thank you, everyone, for watching the video up until the end. That's always great to see. And, of course, if you appreciate that very free content here, scroll down, smash the like button. This really cheers us up every single time. And also remind yourself, guys, if you want to support us and if you want to get some free bonuses as an experienced trader, in the pinned comment, you find a Bybit link, you find a um, Femex link and all the free bonuses just below the most important link today, pandaraswallet.com. So thank you everyone for watching. Thank you everyone for smashing up the like button. Da Vinci, do you have anything to share before we wrap up today's episode? Always play from a position of strength and don't get wrecked. Do not get wrecked, guys. Thank you so much for watching. Thank you so much for smashing up the subscription box, which is popping up right here. Make sure you smash up because otherwise you will be missing out on time-sensitive content in the future. And make sure you smash up the, uh, you smash this Bible tutorial if you haven't watched it already. And that being said, guys, we will see each other very soon at the next one of MM Crypto, maybe in an emergency episode today or tomorrow. And that being said, guys, thank you so much for watching and we will see each other tomorrow. And as always, guys, as always. Bye-bye. <laughs>